Hey guys, James, Motorhome Maniacs here. I wanted to do a quick video tonight. Uh, my solar panel kit came in today, and I wanted to go ahead and uh, and show you some of that. So um, I got it here ready to unbox, and uh, we'll go ahead and we're going to take a look at everything. So. Okay, so I went ahead and already kind of pre-cut the, uh, the tape from the panels off. I haven't opened it and looked at it yet, so you guys will be looking at it for the first time with me. Sorry, I got, got wrestling on right now and uh, um, just, just kind of in the house. So, okay, I got, got my, uh, my kitty here. His name's Meow Meow. Meow Meow. He's about four years old. And uh, he's just a love bug, so half Siamese, just a real fun guy. But anyway, I um, haven't opened this box yet, and like I said, just cut the tape just now so I can slide this off and show you. But uh, let's go ahead and uh, it's from, um, oh, let me turn it around. Sorry, the lighting isn't the greatest in here, but it's from uh, Windy Nations. And I picked this company. Uh, I, I was looking at eBay and a couple other places, and uh, I picked Windy, uh, Windy Nation because of the price and uh, the extra stuff I got with it. I guess there's a company called Renergy and, and things like that, but it was a little bit more expensive. And from the reviews from it, Windy Nation and, and Renergy are, are, I guess it's just preference. So. But I did get the uh, the 200 watt and uh, here's some of the specs of the the panels. Here's their weight and their uh, dimensions. Now it says 20.4 pounds. There's two of them in here. Two 100 watt. So they're you know 20 uh, 10.2 pounds each. And uh, we'll go ahead and pop the the lid off. And I'll take a look at them for the first time along with you. So they packed everything pretty good. Put some foam in there. And uh, there's some extra foam and you know, stuff like that. Everything's taped to the back of the panel. So here's some more, some more specs. Uh, this is the back where where it hooks up, and uh, we got some of this stuff taped taped on. Uh, I guess all the hardware, the wire, the the brackets, the other connectors, screws. So it's packaged pretty good. Also, in this video, I'll go ahead and uh, toss up the link. Um, to exactly where I bought this. I bought this for $559 uh, free shipping. And I got, I went ahead and went with the MPPT controller. It's a 40 watt. I think it's a 40 watt. And I went with the, uh, it came with another little controller. I think it's like a sensor. So it tells you exactly how much battery power you have and, and things like that. So I, I felt like I, I wanted that. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, kind of lift this up real quick. Let you see the panels. Give me a second. So here's the panels. You know, it's, it's actually bigger than I thought. When I got it, I thought these panels were going to be a little bit smaller. But uh, they're actually, you know, for the 500 and something dollars I spent, again, I thought I was going to get something pretty little. And uh, they're actually really good size. So uh, it's going to be nice to get these on there. They look really good. They look real nice. I'll try to get you some close-up of it. And then in this box, which I'm going to open right now, 
is I think the controller and stuff like that. What are you doing, Meow Meow? That's his name. His name's Meow Meow. Meow Meow. He just loves to be pet. Meow Meow. Okay, anyway, sorry. We have another little cat. Uh, she's like a five-month-old black cat. Her name's Emily. She's running around here somewhere. So I'm just kind of opening this up real quick. I'm trying to do it with one hand. Okay. So let's see what I got in this box. Well, I think I opened it backwards. And inside that box is another box. So here is the, uh, the MPP charger manual. I know it's probably hard to read some of this, but I'm just kind of flipping through it. Just, you know, it's sort of a review as well, so you guys can actually, um, <clears throat> you know, for, for some other guys that are starting out and uh, looking for solar, that you can do what I did. It's just a review and show you what you get before you actually get it. I wish someone would have had a good review on this before I got it off YouTube. That would have been pretty cool. But I've noticed a lot of people miss and match a lot of the stuff, so I got this as a kit which I thought was really cool. But enough of that. Let's get to the, uh, the meat and potatoes. Let's see if I can get this open with one hand. So inside this box, we have uh, <clears throat> we have the uh, Ethernet cable that goes to the little the little controller. I'm gonna call it the little controller because I don't know exactly what it's called yet. But I know I wanted it with this package. It, it, it is extra, and uh, it came it came with it. So let me go ahead and open this. Sorry, guys camera might get a little shaky. Okay. So this is what I'm talking about. This is the controller I wanted um, that came with, with the charger. It's a remote monitor. And uh, I guess it really shows more your battery power what you have exactly and stuff like that so um, it was really important to me to have this along with the, uh, the controller I wanted to go MPPT um, just because uh, I've done some research and found out that it you know um, everything you bring in through the solar it actually distributes and, and doesn't waste so you're getting the most out of your solar panels. And that's what I liked about it. You get the most out of your solar panels. So this controller is actually a lot bigger than I thought from seeing some YouTube videos on, on the controller itself. I thought it was gonna be a little bit smaller. But that's okay. Doesn't bother me one bit. Um, it actually feels it's uh, it's at, at least aluminum, some sort of metal. Uh, I got it upside down, but it doesn't it doesn't feel cheap at all. Some of the rattling you're hearing are these this bracket in the back that's kind of it's kind of on there. It's got to be tightened. But here is some of the ports. Again, I got it upside down, so let me... Sorry, guys, I never bought a solar panel kit before. My 
So there's that. Uh, it's got a plastic film over it. I got to peel off. And I guess these are the buttons feel good. I I'm I'm impressed with the construction. It doesn't feel cheap, and that's what I was worried about. I thought it was going to be like a plastic box that would look something like your I don't know AC heater controller in your house. So that's what I thought I was going to get. But uh, this thing's metal. It's pretty cool. It looks like an amp on the back. It's got the ridges. So don't worry. I got it on my soft rug here, so it's not going to do anything. And then, of course, I got, uh, I guess, all my little hardware, extra wires, uh, things like that. So really, that's um, that's going to be great. That's the kit that comes from Windy Nation. And, uh, you know, after cracking it open with you guys, I actually, uh, I think it's, you know, it's built with good quality. And, uh, you know, I'll know again when I get it all set up and put together. But uh, I'm pretty impressed. It's, it's it's really nice. You know, for spending $550, $559 on something I've never bought before, <clears throat> I'm, I'm, I'm happy. It looks like good stuff. So um, next I have to get, get down and get uh, some batteries, some deep cycle batteries. And... Uh, that's where I'll be able to hold the charge for the for the solar. So here in the next day or two, I'm going to run down and uh, uh, pick up a couple, uh, at least two or three uh, deep cycle batteries, 12 volt or 6 volt. I don't know how I'm going to do it yet. I don't know if I'm going to do it in series or or whatnot, but um, I'll figure that out. If you guys got any comments, let me know. And, uh, you know, I'll definitely read them and, and, and see. So... But I'm leaning more towards 6 volt and doing it in series, you know. But I just want to get the most out of it. That's that's my whole goal, get the most out of it. And uh, I'll have to get in the RV and find a spot inside to set everything up. Right now we got the wallpaper off and things like that. I'll show you that in, the, in, the, in another video. But, yeah, these solar panels are cool. I feel like glass. See, you can see the reflection of the TV. They're shiny. I understand why people dust them off and keep them clean now. So it makes sense. But yeah, if you have any comments, if you're looking for a solar panel kit, you have any questions, um, again, out of all the research, this is what I, I bought. Um, I thought it was the best deal and I don't mean best deal money-wise. I mean the best package out there. I'll put a link in the video of the exact same package. And, uh, you know, I, again, I could have got a cheaper 200-watt kit with, uh, what is it, the PWA controller. And um, and not have this this extra little little piece. I think I could have been in the three low 300s for it. But... You know, for the extra, the, you know, the, the nice MPPT, the extra piece, um, you know, 559 I don't, I didn't want to spare no change on it. I wanted to get, get something and have, not have to upgrade later on and say, well, this, this charger is not doing what I need it to do. This controller, let me, let me add this. Let me change this. I'm good. All I got to do now is get some nice batteries and uh, this, this should be more than enough for right now. Um, the controller can also add, um, I think, another uh, up to 600 watts of solar, so I can add another four panels to it, I believe. It's either uh, another two or another four, but um, I got room to expand, so when I get it all hooked up, if I really wanted to add anything back onto the roof, it's just connecting more panels, but um, I, don't, I don't think I'm going to do that. I've learned in the solar that 
your panels really aren't doing doing the work. They're they're bringing in they're bringing in the volts, the amps, but it's your batteries that are doing everything. It's it's your batteries that are that are keeping the charge and stuff like that. So I want to make sure I get a nice a nice two or three uh, deep cycle batteries that'll hold the watts and amps that it's bringing in. So. Yeah, um, I'll go ahead and uh, show another video here in the future of me getting the batteries, and then we'll be uh, looking to get it installed, and I'll have that video up later. Um, just kind of kind of moving along, doing a couple projects at once. I want to kind of get things going, so I uh, hope you enjoy it, and um, we'll talk to you later.